Rock Computer College. Define quality training in information technology. Let's have a look at formatting text in Word. Now, format te formatted text can draw the reader's attention to specific parts of a document and emphasize important information. In Word, you have several options for adjusting text, including font size, font color, and act the actual fonts. You can also adjust the alignment of the text to change how it is displayed on the page. So let's look at changing the font size and I'll be changing the font size of my title, this one. So what you do is then select the text that you want to modify. Then on the home tab, click, click on the font size drop down arrow. And then from here, choose the font size that you want. So let's say I'll go with 36. And by doing so, I've changed the font size. You can also come in here and type in the font size that you want. So if I type in 32, then click enter, the font size will be reduced to 32, just like that. You can also use the grow font, font and shrink font commands. Now these are over here. So if I click on this, my font will grow and it'll be bigger. But if I click on this icon, it will shrink and it will be smaller, just like so. So I'll leave my at that. And I'm satisfied with how that looks. But let's look at changing font color. Um, you can actually change the font color by first selecting the text that you want to modify. So I'll still work with the title. Then under Home tab, come over here to the font color box. Then click the drop down arrow. And you can choose from the theme colors that you have over here. And if you don't find the color that you want over here, you can click on more colors. Then this will pop up. And then from here, you can choose whichever color you want. So I'll go for that color, click on OK, and then it will be applied just like that. You can also change the font of your text. Now to change the font of your text, again, select the text that you want to modify. So I'll select the text, the title. Then on the home tab, click the drop down arrow next to the font box. So this is the font box. Click the drop down arrow. Then you can choose any font you want from over here. So I'll go with this one and then you have changed the font of your text. So they, there are many things you can do with text in wide. You can change the color, the size, and even the font as you have seen. But now let's look at how to use the bold, italic, and underlined commands. Now here they are, the bold, italic, and underlined command. So you can select the text you want to modify. Again, select by clicking and your mouse over, clicking and dragging your mouse over the text. Then click on the bold command, and then your text would be bold. If you click on the underline command, your text will be underlined just like mine. If you want your text to be italicized, let's say I want to italicize, to italicize these first few lines, I can select them, then click on the italics. And as you can see, that whole paragraph has been italicized, just like that. So another thing that you can do if word is to change the text case. So if you've noticed, my title is not in uppercase, it's in mixed cases. But you can actually select it and you don't have to retype the text. So just select the text, then come over here. And select uppercase. Now the other choices there is sentence case, uh, there is lower case, there is uppercase, the one that I want to go with, there is capitalize each word. Here you go, and there is toggle case. But for me, I want to do is put it on uppercase, just like that. And you've changed the case of your text. Now you can also highlight text. So let, let's say you want to you're going through your document and then you realize you've made a mistake and you don't want to make that correction right then. Uh, you want to go and research about it, then come back and make your corrections. You can actually highlight it. Then when you come back to finishing your document, you can work on that highlighted text. So to highlight, just select the text you want to highlight. Then this will appear. Click on the drop down arrow on the text highlight color. 
and choose the color you want to highlight with. So I'll choose red. And just like that, I've highlighted those words. So when I come back to my document and then as I'm going through, I see this thread, I'll be reminded that I need to make a correction over here. And it will be easy to point it out and make the collection, the correction. Now let's look at how to change text alignment. By default, Word aligns text to the left margin in your documents. However, there will be times when you want to adjust text alignment to the center or to the right. So what you'll do is select the text you want to modify. So let's say I want to modify the whole document. I'll select all the text. So I'll under Home tab, I'll come to Select, then click on Select All. Then under Paragraph, we have the line, the left alignment, uh, which is currently, which we are currently on, the left alignment. Then we have the center alignment, we have the right alignment, and we have justified. So you can change to whichever you want. So I'll put mine on justified, and there we have it. Now it's how you change the text alignment in your documents. Mm -hmm.